Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Hello there, Chris. That's my name, and that's the way the email starts from one of our community members at live.perillo.com. You probably know me as Proximity in the chat room or Morning Zoo 44 on my blog. This is odd for me asking a question because I usually research the problem on the internet and figure many things out on my own. Anyway, recently my keyboard has been acting up. My left guitar key, that's control key, <laughs> is being recognized as the home key and everything is just a giant mess. My question is, is there a program I could use or something in Windows XP that can reset my keyboard configuration or is it a hardware problem? Keep up the videos, it's great. Better than call for help. Thanks for the vote of confidence, proximity. I appreciate it. One thing you may want to check is inside your control panel, uh, there is a regional and language options applet. Uh, and this is the first place I would send you to make sure that your keyboard layout is set to a default English US layout. Uh, and if this isn't the case, uh, then chances are something else may be awry. I don't know if it's necessarily a hardware problem unless you were using a different keyboard to type that message. Um, if you go into the regional and language options applet, click the change keyboards button and then you'll be able to flip through a list of language options and you probably have more than one language installed if it's Windows XP. Uh, on Vista I only have the English language installed. Uh, just because, well, that's the only language that I speak. So if uh, changing that doesn't work for you, you may have to download a keyboard remapping tool, and there are plenty of them available, free and shareware, that will allow you to map one key uh, to actually be another key, even though, I mean, the key's face is not going to change that much, but when you press it, you may be able to change the way it works. Again, my guess is that you've inadvertently tripped another language or another keyboard layout um, instead of uh, the default US layout that, that would come with your keyboard. It happens all the time. As a matter of fact, if you go into the regional and language options, not the keyboard applet in the control panel, don't ask me why Microsoft decided to put it in the regional and language options, uh, and you click on the change keyboards button, in here you'll be able to, uh, when you go in further, you'll be able to turn off or on that language bar. I've seen the language bar uh, come up every once in a while after installing some software, and to me it's annoying because, well, I only speak one language. This is where you would turn it on or off uh, and specifically uh, show where it would actually appear on the screen. So there's a couple of tips for everybody there, uh, whether or not you've actually um, had any issues with your keyboard. You may be able to find a few more things in the regional and language options, including other formats. Uh, for numbers, currency, time, short date, and long date. You can customize a lot in Windows, a lot more than you've been led to believe. Well, uh, that's my guess. Uh, if anybody else has a different idea or maybe knows of a specific keyboard remapping tool that they swear by, we'd love to hear about it. Either leave a follow-up comment or swing by the chat room, meet proximity, you know, shake his hand. Maybe he'll autograph his email. I doubt he would do that. Well, anyway, we're always live on the internet at live.perillo.com.